are underway here in this second point. Looks like we have no kills off the opening rush. Start the clock. No kills yet for either team, I don't think. Well, I'll take that back. Ohio State is down one player. Both teams firing off volleys right now. 18 takes out number 13, Evan Bemis. But number 18 also gets taken out. Ohio State down to 12 players on the court, whereas Western has lost, it looks like, two of theirs. So a 13 to 12 advantage in favor of the Toppers right now. Team throw by WKU misses. WKU doing a great job communicating and staying aggressive in this second point. As I mentioned in the first point, Western's Achilles heel has always been that they come out flat in the second point. So let's see if uh, the Toppers remedy that here at Nationals. Oh, it's number 10. Number dot zero, Josh, uh, gets taken out for Ohio State. And a catch by number 16, Alex Big Bird Sorrels, brings back in Austin Dubree. throw, misses, as does the counter throw. The cross court from Western goes right between his legs. Looks like the ball advantage is split right now, five and five, Ohio State pushes back. Three just short on his counter throw. Alex Sorrells misses with his throw to reset the shot clock. Blocked by Nick Johnson. Ohio State very good with their pump fakes. Nick Johnson there taking care of uh, Tanner Boatwright here on the uh, sideline nearest the scorer's table. Western holds the 6-4 ball advantage right now and the man advantage. Oh, Felix Brony takes out number 19 for Ohio State. Ohio State's counter misses captain, uh, alternate captain Felix Peroni. A nice kill there by Dylan Callis that takes out another Buckeye. Western really being aggressive. I think they realized how flat they are in the second point and are really trying to be aggressive and throw this lead here to 2-0. Dexter Banks. Hit on the foot, goes out for Western. Nick Johnson tries to get out number 54, Levine, for Ohio State, but gets taken out. Ohio State has been whittled down to five and will now be on the 10 count. Western still looks to have about 12 players or so. Number 54, Levine going out for Ohio State. The Buckeyes are being whittled down here quickly in this second point. We'll see if uh, Western can communicate and get some good group throws here to take out the remaining Ohio State players. Brett Rice's counter throw misses. Number three resets the shot clock.
A good throw by Big Bird and Peroni doesn't find the target. Five, six, Ohio State really struggling, being pushed to the end of their shot clock almost every time. It gets so difficult when you get down here with fewer players to, uh, to keep from committing a shot clock violation. Nice try to group throw. Peroni and Sorrells are aiming for number 24, but have yet to uh, connect. Five, six, six, seven, eight, nine. A great kill there by J.D. Gillum takes out 24, Patrick for Ohio State. And a catch by Andrew Dockery. Knocks it down to two Buckeyes as number six Retta goes out for Ohio State. Down to number 23 and three six, seven, for Ohio State. Oh. And J.D. Gillum takes out, uh, takes out number three there with a sneaky sideline shot and it is down to one player left for Ohio State. The group throw there for Western misses. Let's see how long he can last in isolation here. Hey. Still alive, claiming it hit ball. Five. J.D. Hey. Gillum creeping here on the sideline closest to the hey. scorer's table. And there it is. That'll do it. Western goes up 2-0 with uh, 9.31 left here in uh, the first half.